Wow, look at this guy. Oh wait, there's more with naked men on them. Is it an unzipping if it's no box? How does it make perfect circles? Anime logic. It's anime logic, yeah, it makes sense. Are you questioning a Rocky sensei's design choices? Hey everyone, welcome oh. to the Ray Chase Shamesy for 30 minutes power hour. That's hey. not the right time frame, but whatever. <laughs> we are going to very slowly open some presents that hopefully have to do with anime and video games. Uh, I brought my own scissors, actually, Rachel. Uh, if you don't mind, let's just uh, get into it. Into it. I need to do <laughs> some set dressing. So, Ray, you obviously voiced this feller over here. Yeah, and then this guy over here and that dude. Over there. For those of you who don't know, all three of these characters are Noctis from Final Fantasy 13. I was looking through my resume and I realized I voice um, black haired guys a lot. Um, and I don't know why that is. Is it different casting directors? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. yes. So shall we? I'm excited. Rachel, you said that uh, some of these are going to be very, very suspect. Uh, I want to see what they are. Or sus as a kid say, oh, you know something, Ray? You actually look kind of cold. Here, I have something you might be able to use, <gasps> you know? Wow! Yeah, just, it's an, it's an XL Japanese size, so. This is, wait, what is going, are there extra? Yes. Oh yes, there's extra zippers on it. This is amazing. You can zip out of your own thing. You can pretend to be the real zipper man from the Marvel comics. Who's zipper man? This is so cool. <laughs> Instead of an unboxing, can we do an unzipping video? It fits perfectly. Thank you very much. This is, this is comfortable. Do I, hey, I don't know what happens at the end of these uh, anime impulse unboxing videos. Does the voice actually get to keep the merchandise? These are all mine. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> get out of uh, here, Ray. Go back to New really, Jersey. This is really, really cool. Wait, can I put this on? Yes, I can. This is like if Bucciarati was in Organization 13. <laughs> His name would be Zunorb. You want to start small, Ray, or do you want to start kind of big? Uh, let's start small, so that way uh, the viewers at home will have something to look forward to. Okay, very well. Um, so on that note, I have um, this little microorganism, <gasps> little fella. Wow. Is this an unboxing if it's wrapped? Is it an unzipping if it's no box? It's a, this is my channel, I do whatever the hell I want. <laughs> yes. Wow. This is... I've always wondered, okay, so his character design, we have found it, I think it's canon, this is a tattoo. Yeah. Uh, it's not actually part of his costume. But what is the deal with this part of his hair? It's a braid. It's a braid that goes from the back forward? Well, like how does it make circles? It's a, it's, it's a, it's a, how does it make perfect circles? It's anime logic. It's anime logic, yeah, are you, it makes sense. Are you questioning Araki Sensei's design choices? <laughs> please, please Are you join, design shaming Araki Sensei? <laughs> Uh, Araki makes Crucify very- Crucify this man. <laughs> he makes very comfortable uh, items. Moving on, um, Ray, so I had the chance to go to Japan this past summer. It's actually where I picked up this fella and this fella. That is awesome. I also had the chance to go to um, a pop-up cafe at the Sega Cafe in Ikebukuro. And at the time it was a collab between, I don't know if you've seen Polar, Bear cafe. It's like a bunch of like these gentle anthropomorphic animals and they just run a cafe. Very and then cool. it was it was a collab between that and Osomatsu-san. Very cool. Polar bear Osomatsu. Yeah, and so we have furry, furry con Karamatsu. <laughs> Sega Collabo Cafe Karamatsu. Karamatsu spirit animal is some sort of bear. Oh, so it is a polar bear. They're all polar bears. It's actually a voice actor reference because in Polar Bear Cafe, Yuichi Nakamura Karamatsu's vo Japanese voice actor, voices Grizzly Bear. I'm trying to think if I've voiced any bears before and I haven't. Sorry, Nakamura-san. So also there at the cafe, they just had this and I'm like, I'm a weakling, so I'm gonna pick this up. But it's like vampire sexy Karamatsu, not the Muppet version. Oh, it's his F6 version. Yeah. This is beautiful. I love, uh, oh, Samatsu is a very, very funny show. And I love that they have their legit anime counterparts just to show that like, yeah, we can do legit anime. We choose not to. We don't want to. He looks like Tuxedo Karamatsu. Yeah. Tuxedo Mas Matsu. Are you gonna take Robbie's job now? Uh, I, my goal in life is to always take Robbie's jobs. Wait a minute, can we do a crossover? Of course. Because I think this is the correct size. Oh. Oh God. It's Jojo Matsu. 
Beautiful. And then it's a crossover between. No, the Bruno doesn't fit. Wait, I have we this. We already stand determined now. this. Will this fit? Karamatsu, Bruno Matsu. Uchi Matsu. Bruno Mars. Bruno Mars toe. Jay, this is not gonna fit. <laughs> you know why Bruno won't um, fit in this? Why? Because this is an enemy stand. Boo! Cut. We're done. Wow. Yes. Look at this guy. He has all sorts of, I'm not unboxing this guy. Oh, he has different faces. Yeah. Oh gosh. He has a, a mirror to look upon himself and despair. Very, very, very cool stuff. I'm so glad that you guys, uh, it's all this Karamatsu stuff because everybody loves my voice from that show, uh, which is out right now. Yeah, totally. Yeah, it's, it's out. You guys have to find it. Mm-hmm. We're opening it. We opened it with Billy too, because I had Osamatsu as well. The writers for Osamatsu, which is being made, is very, very, very funny. Um, I'm, I'm very pleased with a lot of the jokes that they came up with. Yes. There's a lot of crazy opportunities in that show to make jokes. There's a lot of times when they're all talking at the same time. Um, and so for that, there's no translation, there's no script, so we just make up crazy stuff. And I think whoever says the funniest thing, they put louder in the mix. <laughs> This is a Nendoroid. Yes. Ma I've never, uh, I've never experienced one of these things before. Really? Yeah. So they come with different faces. Yes, different faces and different props. Then, Ray, would you like to put him together? Um, does he come with glasses? He does. He has sunglasses. They're like little plastic things. I don't know if that's part of the packaging, or if they go. I think. Oh, it's like little. Sunglasses. Oh, there we go, <laughs> brother. Uh, and he also has a hole in the back. Spoiler alert: Karamatsu dies in the end. They die so many times in that show, it's great. I love yeah, it. Yeah, like the world resets at least yeah. three times that I can ah. remember. Oh, he died. Oh, he's definitely done. He's he is easy to he's easy to Was that his masturbation? Uh, Kara uses both hands. I see. Ambidextrous, that's 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 lit. Oh god, Karen. Uh, Erica Lindbeck, why? <laughs> <laughs> I love what Lindbeck is doing with the Fire Emblem fandom. Just completely turning it on its head. Everyone is so confused now. She's completely finessed the whole Yes. Thing. I hope they make her an official character someday. Please. There we go. He's kind of standing. Okay. Where'd it go? I'll, oh, I'll so. find it. It's clear and it's small, so this is gonna be some fun to look up later. Anyway. <laughs> okay, Ray. This is the last thing. The last thing? The last thing that I have to open with you today. All right. Sorry, it's gonna What's it gonna be? I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, this is not even, this is a real unboxing. Let's get the scissors out. Oh God. Let's really, trying to guess what it is. What's in the box? Um, this is from Ami Ami, which is like a well-known um, Japanese uh, online merch okay. seller. Shout out to Ami Ami. Come Thank through. you for sponsoring this program. <laughs> if only. Really? This is, this is exciting. Okay, Ray. Yes, you will have the pleasure of uncovering what is inside this box. Okay. We've got the logo for Ami Ami. The mascot gals. The mascots from Ami Ami. Thank you guys for watching so much. Please subscribe to my Twitter channel. Oh wait, there's more! <gasps> is this, I know what this is. I thought about ordering it myself because I like using pens with naked men on them. This is the Bruno Bucciarati figure pen. Uh, it has a lot of warnings on it. It's only suitable for ages 15 and up because it's way too sensual. Please read these instructions carefully before you open. It's not suitable for children under three years old due to small parts, not because of nakedness. Um, some components are sharp in shape and fragile. Um, keep them out of the reach of children under 15 years old. <laughs> this is the third time. Uh, I just don't want children to use these. This is Bruno. Ass. Once you see this figure, Ray. He is taking off his, he's unzipping his own outfit. Mid -zip. He's unzipping his own arm. Uh, it's incredible. It smells amazing. It really is. Does he taste amazing, Ray? Ah! No, my God, no. That is the distinct tang of a stylus. I'm going to die. Um, here you are. You just really hate him, don't you? He has very delicate ways of going into things. Okay, here we go. No, don't edit that out. Don't make that dirty. Don't. Please don't. Okay, there you go. He's in it. Uh, this is a reference. Uh, the column is a refer reference to Rome. 
Uh, it's uh, very historical. This is a historical figure, and it can be yours for only $17.95. Um, please call. Please call. Uh, we're on Bucciolati Express. There it is. Uh, great. You got you got a close up of that. Perfect. Get a free kitchen knife if you order now. And put my phone number up there. Uh, great. Thank you, Randy. I love it. Does it work? Let me see. It. Yes, it does. It even writes on his own packaging. I love that thing. Let me see something. Ray, would you mind writing a nice little message to the fans out there? Absolutely. Can we do the honors. Delicately. This is very hard to write on. This is the handwriting of a liar. <laughs> this is the handwriting of a liar. Ari. Ar Ari. Ana Grande. Ari Ana Grande. Ari. Goodbye. What does this say, Ray? This says, Ari, 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 Ari. Goodbye. This is this is awesome. Uh, I'm gonna try my best to sneak out of here with this jacket on and see if they don't notice. Uh, I'm gonna act really nice and then just kind of like make my way out uh, without them even noticing that I'm taking everything home. Oh, he's perfectly pocket sized. Beautiful. I love it. This is great. I will have you deported back to New Jersey. This is very fun. <laughs> deported. <laughs> Thank you for having me on. I've always wanted to be on an Anime Impulse. You guys do amazing work. And I'm very excited to see how this turns out. Guys, thank you so much for watching this uh, crazy unboxing. We're gonna see how much of this stuff I'm gonna be able to take home with me. Uh, follow me at Ray Chase. It's uh, my Twitter account. Uh, it's, uh, I also have an Instagram account that I don't use very much, at Ray Chase Nation. Like, comment, and subscribe to Anime Impulse. This is a freaking cool YouTube channel and they got a whole lot more coming. Stay tuned. If you see this man with my belongings, arrest him on the spot, please. You gotta catch me first. Zip! Arrivederci.